So I have been trialing the Samsung Smart Things Smart Home Intelligent Living Starter Kit um, from Samsung. Uh, it's uh, connected devices um, for the Internet of Things. It uh, consists of a, a hub, right, which is the, the white box to the, the left, a motion sensor and a home plug as well as a um, multifunctional uh, sensor which is uh, connected to a door or cupboard and it detects when uh, there's opening or closing of uh, a door uh, or cupboard you could even put it on the drinks cupboard to uh, you know see when uh, certain illicit substances are being consumed or you could put it on the fridge and monitor that um, and when it triggers, um, it will uh, connect to uh, the hub and let it know that it's, something's happened. It will either send you a message or um, it could uh, trigger another response. So uh, with this motion sensor, I've set it up um, to connect to this, this desk lamp. Uh, when there is motion, um, so in the evening um, or when we've gone to bed, uh, the light will go out. And that's set on a timer, so I can say, you know, 10 o'clock bedtime, um, or I can trigger that uh, early on the um, the app, the Smart Things app. And I can tell it to uh, turn the light off uh, and then um, watch out for any motion uh, during the evening. So uh, that uh, picks up when uh, a door is opened or um, somebody walks across the room and it turns the light on uh, so you don't have to leave the lights on all night um, but you get a light as soon as you need it um, to see your way around um, and um, yeah you could do it to any other devices as well um, there are other a whole range of um, kit that is um, can connect to some home thermostats um, alarm systems uh, bulbs that connect with the Philips Hue bulb systems and um, yeah it was uh, fairly easy to connect a few of the devices one of them had a slight problem where the battery wasn't connected properly so I did have to just uh, take the battery out and put it back in but uh, apart from that the kit uh, all worked um, perfectly um, haven't had any major issues um, one thing I'm trying to do is I'm trying to um, connect through the um, if this then that that's uh, another sort of that's a website and an app um, which you can connect through um, various um, other apps on your smartphone uh, so if a trigger happens then it can play something on Spotify or uh, it can just do loads of loads of things. Um, unfortunately, there's a problem at the moment with the oath um, authentication of that, um, which is being worked on. Uh, so hopefully, um, the next few weeks, we'll be able to uh, give some information about that and um, you know, give a, give some information just to tell you whether it works or not. Um, but um, I. I'm assured that it uh, should be uh, working in the next couple of weeks. So yeah, like I say, the, the main thing that I'm using it for at the moment uh, is to uh, trigger the light response. Um, but I'd like to be able to connect it to my speakers, my CTTV camera. Um, so at the, at the moment, the devices that I've got at home um, aren't fully compatible with this system. Um, and I do have, you know, I think it's like, um, I have status home plugs where you can just use a remote control um, and trigger them uh, lights so where the plugs are hard to reach. Um, would be nice if I could integrate those all together so I wouldn't have to um, change the plugs. But uh, that's maybe a project for the future and I'm certainly, certainly looking into uh, doing that uh, at the moment. But I'm really happy with the kit. I'm pleased that I, I, I um, 
signed up for for the uh, project and I'm happy with my uh, Samsung smart things.